A show business agent friend of mine, 25 years ago, told a young newspaper man who wanted to break into show business to give up, that he had no future there. The young newspaper man was Ed Sullivan. Ed died last night of cancer at age 72. Sullivan stayed a newspaper columnist, but he also broke into show business and became a star in his own right through his Sunday night CBS television show. Today, CBS television president Robert Wood said, no man appreciated, aided, and advanced aspiring young talent as consistently as Ed Sullivan. Bob McNamara narrates our report. Sullivan called his television show Toast of the Town. And over the years, the show and Sullivan became American institutions. For nearly a quarter of a century, he booked the biggest acts in show business into millions of living rooms. Though some said he did nothing, they also said he did it better than anyone else. His format was simple, was so open true. with a big act. Tonight is a really big shoe. He'd follow with something for the kids, and always he wanted to keep it clean. Sullivan's acts range from animals to extravaganzas. Elvis! What Ed Sullivan possessed most was a nose for the new. And the Beatles! And in the face of criticism, he was instrumental in changing American musical taste. Ed Sullivan admitted he was no performer. And time after time, he tried to prove it. In a business where many shows last less than one season, Ed Sullivan survived 23 years. He was successful, he said, because I'm the best damn showman on television. Few would dispute that claim. Bob McNamara, CBS News, New York.